So Izzy's just come up with a great idea for the thumbnail and the title of this video. There's only a section, a certain section of the video with a you know what in it. You'll have to wait and find out. So if this video on YouTube goes viral, it's all down to Izzy. For one, coming up with the idea and two, being the subject of the thumbnail. written a poem about Budapest which I would like to share with you now. Budapest it is better than all the rest at a simple but beautiful Airbnb you'll be our guest I do not jest about the sacred land of Budapest. Izzy, mm -hmm. what rhymes with Budapest? Mm -hmm. Huh? I don't know. Father, eh? I don't know. <laughs> There's a German word that rhymes with est, that rhymes with est. No. There's no German words that rhyme with est. Best. Do so. There's only eight words that you can think of that rhyme with Buddha. If you like cheese, you can eat Gouda. We've been out for some food, eh? Ready for the day? Yeah. yeah. Right, first mission of the day. I left my sunglasses in Belgium, so we're gonna get some sunglasses from Budapest. Isabel's initial suggestion is to go and have a look in DM, so that's where we're going. Right, okay, mission one complete. Explain to us what you've got. Austrian lemonade. Austrian lemonade, right, okay. So this is what we're trying. It's like Sprite with a, a little bit of iron brew in it. That's what it tastes like. With every bang, it echoes down the river. We've also had a bit of a disaster on our first mission. We've got the sunglasses, but the left lens is warped. So we're now trekking to find another shop to get some sungla more sunglasses. For fuck's sake. Oh dear. Have you seen what it what it is? Yeah. Oh dear. Hey mum, fancy bringing Des for a, tri a trip to uh, Budapest? Def Leppard and Motley Crue. I think.
think if I remember rightly, Mum's just taken Des to see Molly Crew. Might be a, a cheeky opportunity to come to Buda. <laughs> What do you think? Nice. Very clean. Yeah. This is kind of what I was saying to your dad in Belgium as well. A lot of the old historic buildings here and in Belgium are very well maintained. Yeah. If new buildings are, uh, are created, they're done in the style of the old buildings. Yeah. But we're not here to see these buildings. We are here to find coffee. For Isabel. The caffeine fiend. The coffee ninja. <laughs> I nearly fell down these stairs. Two things we've learned from Budapest. One is don't follow signs, because they're liars. And number two is always take a lift or an escalator. I think that bear is not feeling very well. You having fun? We got easy on an e-scooter. After forcing me to wear a hat, I forced Izzy to ride one of the e-scooters through Budapest. It was an experience. Uh, we didn't park it in the right place, but we've done it now, we've completed it. So all that's left to do is get a one, on one back home. But yeah, we're gonna go into the market now. I'm hungry and thirsty, so we're gonna try a bit of food and a drink. And let's have a little look what we can see on the inside of the big main market, indoor market in Budapest. Hello, um, can I have tropical? Sweet. They're good. I'm taking a bit of feedback from that comment that we had from Iceland, the market hunt in Iceland. Uh, don't, just whiz past everything. Well, 
artistic director just packing away my uh, flying camera. Are you tired? Hungry? Yes, same. Let's go and get some goulash or something. So is it Asia Discont? Or is it Asia Datcont? <laughs> so my biggest problem with Budapest is everywhere is worthy of being recorded. We've got so much footage of this place, it's ridiculous and we haven't even scratched the surface. Uh, doing another souvenir shop, get some little bits and then we're going to go and grab a bite to eat. And then we've got the Budapest River Cruise, oh yeah. Myself opening a bistro in Budapest. <laughs> Maybe a business opportunity in the future. So, as you can see, I've just sampled some, would you say, Lagos, uh, which is a local delicacy, flatbread with toppings. It's basically a flatbread pizza. It's when Isabel ate some chips from her lap. Then she sat down and spilled, spilled her chips all over her dress. Can you see it now? No. We're all good. I have had another thought as well. Oh, look at that. Oh, does it just look cool because I've got my glasses on? Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> another thought that I've just had is in most cities and stuff, there's a, a very clear divide between rundown areas and money areas whereas in Budapest because you can have like a shop with graffiti on it right next to one of these big historical looking banks and things like that you don't see a massive divide between the areas it, it all is one and the same thing so that's just my little thought about Budapest we're now gonna have a walk down the riverfront we've got an hour before the river cruise. I think we're going to try and find the shoes on the Danube. So let's go and have a look. So we're just coming up now to the uh, the shoes on the Danube and um, I'll put up a little bit of more information on screen just explaining exactly what these shoes represent.
Probably the coolest yeah. shot of the whole video. <laughs> so that, in theory, concludes our trip to Budapest. However, We may have one last treat in store. And it's 
not just this band. Let's go and have a look. This could be our final stop. on the same side. You know when you ask me whether I'm going to be okay with this, I'm not sure. No, I'm joking, I'm alright. I'm only playing up for the camera. Imagine she lived in there. People all day watching you have breakfast, watching you eat your lunch, watching you watch telly. Oh, the hotel co coronavirus is there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, is he is rocking it? We're like trapped at the top. Oh, is he is rocking it. Oh, <laughs> it, stop moving it. Anyway, in fairness, as we're overlooking Budapest, it's probably the best time to finish this video. Have you enjoyed yourself? Yeah. I went, yeah, I was talking to you, not them. Well, that was what I mean, didn't yes. She's just said, oh, look at all these people just sat on their phones. Anyway, yeah, so we'll end the video here. I've had a really good time. We've done plenty of stuff, but also we've had a nice rest because it's been knackering doing this trip. But actually, at the same time, it's, it's been a really cool trip. Perfect way to end a perfect trip. Is there any thing you want to say to end the Budapest video. Do it again. We'll do it again. We'll definitely be back at some point. I'll leave uh, links to all the places that we've been to in the uh, description. So from Budapest, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> goodbye. What did I say? Promised you. <laughs> Sorry, boob. Boobs. Beers. In Budapest. <laughs> you tit. Do not drop your phone. Hey, are you not been in this video with me? Sorry. <laughs> we're not, not going to stop again, so I might stop <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, perfect way to end a perfect trip to Budapest. Gas in your arm.